Hey guys, I'm LB, and after that fumbly bumbly request for Thinking with Time Machine Map, we got a request from Quentin called Just Beat It. Look at this, custom visuals, custom story. A hammer map in Thinking with Time Machine communicate, uh, community workshop. <laughs> hard map series. No ninja skills required, just hard thinking. There's a couple tips. Difficulty 7.5 out of 10. We'll see about that. And there's an official walkthrough. Excellent. Right. I think this might be the first hammer map that I've played in Thinking with Time Machine. Oh no. <laughs> what is it with Quentin and Undertale music? Okay, so... <laughs> I have a video on my channel of one of Quentin's maps that's like a time travel machine map or whatever. And I guess because it has time travel machine in the title, it gets a ton of views. It has like several thousand views now. And the Undertale music seems to be helping, because I have so many comments about the Undertale music. So yeah, I have actually heard Undertale music now. I've seen the game. And unlike in that previous video, what's with that glass? That glass turns transparent when I look a certain way. So, uh... Yeah, this- I know this song, but it's not linked in the description. I don't know if it's, a, if the, if it's the original or if it's a remix. I'll have to ask Quentin. Anyway, we have a portal surface doesn't do much for us. Can I just hold above the glass? I totally can. What am I doing in this map, though? Okay, that's not portalable. That ant line goes to something. What does that ant line go to? I can't even tell. Oh, does it go... to the funnel, I guess? What is with the ant- the ant lines don't look quite right for some reason. Something about that just doesn't quite seem right. Oh, 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 what is going on? What are you doing to me, game? I can't walk on this, right? I'm pretty sure this would kill me. Huh. Oh, yep, that's- that's death. So, <laughs> that is, a. Uh... am not sure that death is supposed to look like that. <laughs> it's like my head fell off. Hmm... Guess I'm just a dummy. How do I actually do anything? Like, I know I can record! Yep, yep, we're playing Thinking with Time Machine. I don't- I don't get what- I don't need- I don't see how I need to do anything here, though. Can't portal over there easily, I need to turn on the funnel somehow. In order to do that, I need to put a portal above the funnel. And I don't see a way to do that without killing myself. Like, unless I'm supposed to record... Okay. Let's record this this. And maybe I can use my clone portals to then place my own portals? It's been a while since I've done stuff like that, so... And... Hey, maybe that will work. Okay. Well, that's the thing I've done now. So I guess now I just need to head over there? Well, let's hope that the game save works properly. Interesting. There's a, a myriad of things wrong with this map, but that's okay. Well, at least this works, that's nice. So I guess this was an, a, uh, a TWTM Puzzle Maker export that was hammerized in some capacity. Oh no... Alright, well, let's move that out of the way. Uh... Do I want to put this here, or... What's the best way to get over there, anyway? S what? Wait, what? What? Star? Where's the connection for that? Apparently we can use the funnel ourselves at some point? Oh, that's... Okay. Where's the safe plate take me, actually? Hmm. I wonder if I can get lucky with that. Cause those- those floor buttons in Thinking with Time Machine are kinda magnetic, so if, if you can hit them in just the right way, you can actually get the cube to stay on. Alright, for the- uh... Okay, whatever, I don't have long ridge use. <laughs> 
I was gonna say, for- for sake of saving time, we could try and just call the queue back over to me. That's so close! Oh man, come on now. Come on, land on there. Oh my gosh! It's sliding off. Okay, okay, fine. We'll do this the normal way, like a normal person, I suppose. Get in there. Well, that was weird! <laughs> I told you they're magnetic or something. Well, hey, look at this. At least this time, we can get over there more easily, without having to do any sorts of nonsense. Alright, so I guess the clone can do the lasers, right? That would be my guess. Alright, so... We'll just record that for a little while, and then I'll guess I'll stand here. And then move that out of the way. And uh Do I need to respawn the cube? No, because then what would I do with it? Huh. I don't know. Let's- let's just- let's work on this assumption for a while. So that would easily push us over there. What about... I don't want to move the cube because... Huh. I guess we'll see. Let's just head on over here and maybe- maybe I'll get lucky or something. Now let's start over this recording, please. Come on, step on the button. So that opens the door, and I can't just run through. Huh. What am I supposed to do about that? Huh. Alright, maybe I'm supposed to start recording from here, actually. So. Let's save in this position, and... I'll start recording here. And... Go over here. And stand here. Oh, um... Or do I need a cube? That's the thing I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. There we go. Um... I don't know if I did a good thing or not, honestly. Well, crap. Well, crap. <laughs> uh... I think this is all just badness. Let's, uh, stop recording. And let's see if loading the save works. Um... Okay, that's- that's a good sign, it's doing something. Okay, that seems to have worked. That's at least good news, for the most part. Now, what do I actually need to, need to do? Huh. As fun as this music is, it's actually a bit distracting. Because it's a little bit too entertaining, if you know what I mean. Uh, why did I just do that? Crap. <laughs> I- I wanted to be over there. And the thing is, you can't use the funnel to push the cube to you, because... There's only one cube that-, that we don't have Talos Principle cloning cube logic. If we take the cube off the button, that portal surface closes. So we definitely needed the cube there to get ourselves over here. There's this button, and there's that button. I don't think there's a way to have both pressed at once, unless we use a bug. Huh. How would we do this? So we can do this from here. 
And that's about the extent of what I can do from here. And I don't know what to do for that. What's, uh, what's my current stored procedure? Right, that's the current stored procedure. Yep, that opens the door that I can't get through. That certainly works. What happens if the clone places a portal, and then the clone's portal surface goes away? I've actually never tried that. Well, let's go try it, shall we? Oh, excuse me. Alright, so, let's, us. Uh, what does the current program do? The current program is to shoot a portal there, and there... ...and stand there. Okay, so... What if we do that, but then also... So we do that... for at least a while. And then, once I've gotten safely over to this side again, or whatever... Then we'll try to do... something slightly different, whereby... my clone will then use... This portal surface and that. And again, I don't actually know what's going to happen here. I don't know. I honestly don't know what this'll do. But, uh, we're trying it. Alright, so. Stop recording. Stop the presses. And, uh. We'll save here. This thing is vibrating to the music. It's got a song in its head, and the song is in my head too. Right. Play, please. Oh, are you kidding me? You missed that portal shot? Oh my gosh, you're a failure of a clone. How do you miss that portal shot? Okay, fine, I guess we'll have to make this a bit easier for the game. There, let's try that. Give that a little while... And then... And then... Do this... And that. And again, I don't know what's gonna happen here, cause I'm gonna shoot the portals for that... And that to activate that, so it should turn on the funnel, but the clone's portal is here, and I don't know what happens to the clone's portal if the portal surface it's on goes away while the portal is still open for the clone. It's like, it's a big mystery, who knows what happens. Right, so, we've done that. Um... Save, and let's hope it works this time. Play, please. Okay, that portal got placed, that's good news. Let's get across here. Alright, so let's, let's get ready for the clone to form an action here. Come on. Do your thing, clone. What?! How did you miss that shot?! Oh, cause my portal was still there. Oh. Well, that's okay, we can just- we just have to replay this part again. Alright, now we just gotta wait, again. Can't go through here... Can't go through here... Can't go through here... Gotta actually solve the puzzle. Come on, Chell clone. Clone Chell. Do your thing. This is a problem with... this time machine mechanic. Is, uh... Alright, so then I do this and this. Uh-huh. So that's what happens. Yeah. But anyway, we can watch the clone teleport now. Yeah, I kinda figured something like that would happen. So the clone's portal got cleared, and the clone just teleports over there. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's clearly not it. 
So, what might we do... instead? Like, I know what we can respawn the cube if we need to, but... The thing is, if we respawn the cube, we would need to already be over... Hmm... The issue is that the clone would need to be able to get... over there. I wonder... what happens... I need to test this, so if I look up when I'm recording... and press E... that says use there. So what does that actually do? Interesting. That's something I've heard about, but I never actually tested it. So we can actually record something that we don't actually do until we play back the recording. Right, so let's put the cube there. And get back over here. So let's see. First of all... Let's, uh, record this. Like that. There we go. And then I'm not sure what to do. Because I can't clone- I can't get myself over here right now. Yeah, what am I supposed to do now? I need the cube on one of these buttons, I need the clone on the other button. So... What exactly am I supposed to do here? Wait a bit for the cube to appear. I guess pick up the cube, and, uh... Then what? Put the cube here? And then... Then what? I guess we can use this technically, even though we're not supposed to be able to. And I can't stand on there, I can't get over there in any capacity. There's no way to have the funnel without the clone active. So I can't get over there. Right, because I needed to start recording from there, maybe? Uh, okay. Let's see if any of this works so far, though. Oh, you're kidding me! Oh, it still works. Good. Thank goodness. Okay. There we go. Right, so let's head over here and actually start recording from here this time. I don't want the clone to respawn the cube just yet, so... Right. First of all... Clear the recording... Before we save. Oh, and... I'll be right back. The game just crashed. Alright, I'm back. And, uh... Yeah, sometimes this game just crashes when you quick save, even if your recording length is, like, extremely minimal and small. So... We need to get over there again, which means I need to do some recording over here again. Right, right. So... Portal there... Portal there... I don't know why it's so hard for this game to, like, actually record portal shots properly. Alright, that's good enough. Oh my gosh! What is wrong with you, game? Ah! Okay, this is frustrating. Something about that portal surface is just not working out. There's that, and that. I think that one should work, because I aim at the very low side of that. 
wait a few seconds, and... There we go. And... play. There we go, that works. Right, okay, so. Please let me save over here. Yes, okay. That's her save point. Let's, uh... Let's avoid overriding it. So, we need to start here. I believe we need to start here, because that way when we start the recording, the cube will have already been placed there. And then we can just walk through the door. But the thing is, this recording has to be used for multiple purposes. We ha- the recording has to allow us to get from there to here, while also having to put the cube on the button, and also starting here to open the door when the cube is there. Okay, that's a bit of a nightmare, but we can do it. Alright, so the recording starts here. That should be enough to get us through the door. And, uh... Let's see here. So there's that. That should be enough to get us... across. And we need to put the... the cube... on there now, so let's- let's move this out of the way. Alright, that counted as using there. And then in a moment, the cube will be here. So there's that. And there's that. That might be enough. Alright, I stopped recording, and... let's go see if that'll work. Come on now. Stop- stop bugging out on me, cube. Alright, so this is enough to get us over here. Now, will you put the cube on the button for me? Now it's funny how it got lifted up in the air there by the funnel. And... Yes, it pushed the button. That's good news. Will you pick it up? Yep, that's good news. And... Yes! Drop it. Good. Start playback. Yeah, right! Well, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!